weeks ago, the kind folks at Moment asked us if we wanted to join them on a trip to Arizona the following week. We were like, yeah, AF, big mood. And seven days later, we were loading into a van in Phoenix. We started things off watching the sunset over the Grand Canyon. It went something like this. We should buy this chunk of property right here. We build a house, something modest, but this is going to be our view from the breakfast table. Every morning we look out, we see the Grand Canyon. Just kidding. It went like this. After we checked that off the old bucket list, we roasted marshmallows over a campfire. Marshmallows. And swapped horror stories about demonetization and apocalypse. A few hours later, we were up before the sun and hiking the path to Uwa Point. This wasn't your grandma's Arizona. The air was frigid, the wind was fierce, but the view was worth it. After we thawed out, we made an unexpected stop by some painted hills. Nice stones. In a rush to catch Horseshoe Bend before sunset, we almost left some things behind. Now, we've seen Horseshoe Bend a million times on social media, but we were not prepared for the magnitude of it. After taking it all in, we watched some vloggers totally harsh our nature vibe. Oh wait, is that Niles and Caleb? I mean, we watched some vloggers totally kill it with their charisma in the wild. As the sun dipped behind the bend, so did our stance against shooting danglers. Finally, our trip came to a close with a visit to Antelope Canyon, another shack off our bucket list. We took a guided tour through the narrow passageways. Caleb really hit it off with our guide. So much so that he sweet talked her into letting us have a few minutes to ourselves in the canyon. Back in Phoenix, we said our goodbyes and left for home. Thanks, Moment, for having us out on this amazing trip. 